Hello, Scorpio. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to uh, my channel for some of you guys. Some of you guys are doing well. So this is your general, your general love reading for July. How time flies. Uh, we're going to take a look and see who's showing up in your reading. See what they're thinking and feeling regarding yourself. And of course, vice versa as well. Guys, feel free to jump ahead to the start of the reading. It is timestamp. If you click in the description bar below, see where it says start reading. Click on that. And that will, that will bring you to the uh, start of the reading. This section is really for those that just kind of prefer to see me shuffle on camera. Okay. I always say just take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Ah, uh, let's put them there. Perfect. I'm going to take these in and I shall be back. So Scorpio, let's start your reading and of course take whatever side resonates with you guys and picking up as uh, this being your side, the person that you're dealing with over here, but you can always flip switch whatever side just kind of resonates the most. All right. So this is interesting because I don't feel like there's much communication, if any, really communication between the both of you, Scorpio, um, because for you, it seems like there has been some form of transformation. I'm trying to push this down a bit. Actually, I don't really need to. Seems like there's been some form of transformation around maybe your thinking regarding this situation and this person. We've got the death card there, which represents huge transformation. When we're talking about the death card, we're talking about something ending. Um, but of course, with an ending, there's always a rebirth. So this transformation, I feel like it's something to do with your thinking around this situation. Um, which is causing you to want to do something different with the page. There is this level of drive around taking action. But I feel like in the past, or there's an element of fear around this for you, with that three of swords there. But still willing to push past it, or still willing to want to take action regardless. It's like this, feel the fear, but do it anyway type of thing. But definitely a transformation in terms of your thinking, you're thinking about coming together with this person to kind of create that 10 of pentacles. So when we're talking about the 10 of pentacles, we're talking about, you know, relationship, exclusive relationship, um, maybe moving in together, maybe getting engaged, that type of thing. And developing, if you haven't already, this strong emotional connection um, with this person. Well, with your person. And this is kind of why I feel like maybe there's been no, no communication because this person is very much drawn towards you. Highly attracted, very much drawn towards you. We've got a lot of cups here, or at least we have three. We've got the fulfillment card there. So that ten of pen that ten of pentacles. Ten of cups. This talks about emotional fulfillment. And then on top of that, we do have the ace of cups. I feel like this person has already developed and that might be the case for you as well, but has already most definitely developed some form of um emotions for you in terms of care, even love. Um yeah, even love, but I feel like they're needing to process their emotions. Uh, we've got the Ten of Cups again in their feeling position, but I feel like they need to process it. It's like they need to think about this. I need to process what it is that I'm feeling here, but they're keeping that to their self, keeping that to their self, still wanting things to turn out um, with that Six of Wands there, which talks about victory, uh, being victorious. Yeah, so that kind of gives me the sense that there's no communication or not much communication. Yeah, which brings us to where we are at the moment. You're kind of in this space with the three of wands of waiting. Seems like there's an element of you waiting for something to happen or waiting with the three. Um, not comfortably as well with that five of uh, pentacles there. Just kind of waiting but not being, not comfortable waiting as well. It feels like there's a bit of, um, how do I put that? Chilly, frosty, feeling uncomfortable, feeling maybe disconnected, feeling left out in the cold. There we go. That sense of maybe left out in the cold, being left out in the cold, but wanting an opportunity to build with this person, build with this person. But there is that king, which talks about, yes, of course, emotional, Stability and loyalty and reliability. When we're talking about the king, we're talking about, yeah, this is a serious person, a uh, very committed type of person. 
but that can also represent a level of emotional maturity in terms of how you're dealing with this as well. But I feel like that's more for a lot of you to do with you wanting an opportunity to actually establish something where you're offering that stability, you're offering that loyalty and that reliability there. But there is this choice with the two that you're needing to make. It seems like this person has either received some form of information um, with the eight there, some information that's come in. I don't think for a lot of you it's, or it could be, I mean, it could be you waiting on a response from this person. That's for some of you though. Uh, but there is something around this person receiving information, information, which is kind of making them think about wanting to take a risk on this, but waiting or wanting a solution or an idea. And again, we've got this patience around their thinking as well, around how they're dealing with this, because there is this awareness that something's come to an end with the seven, sorry, with the 10 of uh, swords there, but still having this feeling this intuition, the intuition is kicking in or has kicked in that they're needing to just kind of be, again, we've got that patience card there, but we also got the king around something that's maybe come crashing down, which is why I feel like a lot of you, you're not really in contact or communication, but wanting to, or feeling the need to kind of deal with this in a, 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 a mature way, a mature way, be strategic in terms of how they move or just kind of be thoughtful and mindful in terms of how they handle this. The moves that they make when it comes to this. Yeah, this is an interesting read there. Going back to this choice, this choice, Scorpio, this choice, this choice, there's a feeling of you needing to make a choice because I feel like for, not to say, I, I, you know, just based on their spread, I doubt that to be true. And if it is true, then engaging in some form, maybe dating someone else, speaking to someone else, um, then it's not serious because like I said, we're going back to the, the emotions that this person has towards you. But I feel like you feel that this person could maybe, maybe be dating, engaged in some form of relationship, but having peace around that or some form of acceptance around that. Not to say it's going to stop you from making any moves, but there is this level of, okay, it's like it's kind of like, okay, well, they could be dating someone else or they could be, okay, so I, I'm, okay, I'm going to accept that if that is the case. So I got to take that into consideration or be mindful of that. Um, but I'm still going to, I'm still, I'm still wanting to make a move or I'm still thinking about this choice. There's a choice around whether maybe you're going to make the move or not. Yeah. Interesting. This is interesting. Yeah. So it's like you're thinking one thing, they're thinking another. Um, no communication. I don't feel what we're going to do now. Let me just see if I can, if I can, if there's anything else I can give you guys before we actually move into part two of the reading. We'll see where this moves to. Um, mm, the emphasis is on this waiting for you, waiting waiting until you come to some form of decision about this choice this choice yeah so let's move into part two of the reading and we'll see where this moves to for those of you that are interested the link is in the description bar below so click on that um other than that guys have a beautiful beautiful day and i shall see you next week